What's up, children of the sun? This is your metaphysical advisor, Montre Bible. <clears throat> Thought I'd do a little check-in on Joe Biden again, part two. Uh, I did a reading on Joe Biden at the beginning of the year. And there was some, you know, a little disgruntle. And I think I saw the impatience with the money and all that stuff. Now let's see what else is going on. So Angel Spirit, God's ancestors, creator of all, please give me insight into Joe Biden's presidency for the next three months. We're going to be looking into, um, it's the month of April right now. So we're going to be looking at um, April, May, and June. So we are going into the summer equinox. What's going to happen with Joe Biden and presidency for the next three months? Thank you. Creator of all, please give me a sight. What do we need to know? Let's show Biden up to you for the next three months. What's gonna happen with him? Ooh, a lot of stuff. I feel like a lot of busy energy here. Like these cards are just all over the place. Look at that. Whoop. Already, look at there. <clears throat> the Hierophant Reverse. This talks about doing things non-traditional, uh, going away from the norm. Hmm. All right, okay. I'm just going to do three cards for this one. Or not. That's too many. But that is the Prince of Cups. Um, as I said before, uh, bringing in something new. Um, when I said I said this in another ring, I always see the cups as medication sometimes. Not just love, but bringing in that cup of something. <laughs> uh, Scorpio energy as well. What is Joe Biden? Is he a Scorpio or a Sagittarius? The Ten of Pentacles. This is a lot of money being spent. <clears throat> and the Two of Cups. Separation. Um, there's going to be some kind of division. Um, there may be a separation or a division between people. But there's a lot of money being spent here. He's doing things in a very non-traditional way. He's going to try something different. And the Ten of Pentacles tells me that there may be some overspending happening. If there is another stimulus, which I have heard of, this might be a little bit too much overspending. And then the Two of Cups, something happening around June, which separates people. Um, Queen of Wands um, could be a female figure involved, could be Camilla. This is someone who's very just thinking about themselves, um, trying to put themselves in place. Once again, Prince of Cups pops up again. Uh, this could be, um, I'm kind of getting, this might be somebody else, Prince of Cups, but also him, someone may be in charge of like some kind of medicine or something, but also someone who's very passionate coming in, Scorpio energy, and two of wands, having to, two choices of action, having to go two different ways, two, two of pinnacles, taking it step by step. Two different choices, two, two, two plans of action, and that kind of sense in that he may have somebody around him. One person might be saying, go this way. The Queen of, Queen of Wands is like, go that way. And so trying to make a one step. He's got a lot of people. This is looks like an administration here. Prince of Pentacles. These are people underneath him. A lot of princes here. Someone's trying to say, take it slow. And the Six of Cups, trying to find happiness. Hmm, a lot of energy here. I do see he's trying to do things in a traditional way, and people are divided about what's going to happen. Let's see what's up with this. <clears throat> New information, once again, the, that, that Knight of Cups, which is the Prince of Cups, popping up again, talking about stepping away. Someone's stepping away. We got the Page of Swords, talks about um, maybe spying, uh, new information coming in uh, this summer. Or in the month of April, new information coming in, and then someone trying to step away, or step away, or step down, because maybe uh, they don't like the spending. Clarify the um, Two of Cups, please. Yeah, there's a lot of there's. I feel like summertime is going to be really stressful uh, for many people, and there's going to be some kind of division because of the stress that's happening. Um, 
Joe Biden's going to try something different. And it's going to cost some money and it's going to make some people walk away or step down. Um, but this is based upon some new information, though, that comes in. And because of that, and I think the people around him, the Queen of Wands and Prince of Cups, are trying to put a bugs in his ear. And they're like, okay, well, here's something to do. And he's going to try to take it one step at a time, trying to balance out this energy and go slow. But it's still, and that's kind of his energy anyway. It's kind of, <laughs> kind of going slow. Let's pull some oracles here. But I feel like there's going to be some type of division. I don't know if it's between America and Americans or there's something in his administration. People are divided in his administration, but it's something that has to do with the Ten of Pentacles, which talks about like overspending. And it could be that the two different parties, you know, Republicans and Democrats, divided on this spending bill or, or how much money he's spending. Moon card for what's going on with Biden. Emotions are running high. Going to be an emotional summer. This is why I think there's going to be some division, some separation. People are stressed out about what's about to happen, what he's bringing in, trying to do something different. What are the oracles for Biden in the next three months? Ooh, Colonel. Um, this is about the body. This could be having to do with all everybody's health. This is definitely about the physical body and things happening with the body. So, um, could be related to the vaccines, trying something different, spending a lot of money on something. I'm not gonna do the angel oracles. I'm gonna do this oracle. <clears throat> What's going on, Biden? Okay, all right, all right. Then there's going to be peace. Okay. So there's going to be a, some disagreements happening, and then there's going to be peace. And it could be that people are arguing about, because the carnal is all about just the earthly things, the body. And then after some disagreements, then there will be finally be peace. Or maybe it's that people want peace. So I've been hearing a lot of things about war. So is this Ten of Pentacles about war? Is this Ten of Pentacles reverse about going to war? I've been hearing a little bug in my ear about war. Let me see here. Yes. Nope. No. It's a little bit. There's some spinning going on with war because that, that Knight of Pentacles is saying okay. But he's trying to say take it slow not getting a wish fulfillment and also the ten of cups some kind of like worried about uh separating families this is not the time people are like okay take it slow he is putting some spinning there but it's not completely about war because there are little people are nervous about separating families during this time this is probably not the time to do it and so that wish trying to get a war going may not happen but he is putting some money toward it but it's not all the money <clears throat> so clarify this Ten of Pentacles for me. Who's leaving? Why is the Ten of Pentacles reverse? Clarify the Ten of Pentacles. Yeah. Something that was hidden coming to the light. So this is might be why. I feel like with something hidden... The moon card, people are being on an emotional high. This kind of confirms this right here. This moon, talk about emotions are running high. This is a very emotional card. Um, this is about secrets. It's something coming out. And then this may not, this may make people not like him too well. So whatever's coming out, it's about how the money's being spent. It's about um, some secrets about how the money's being spent. And it's very divisive and it causes a lot of stress. But don't worry, things are never that bad as it's because the dust spirit's going to sit. Is here to bring peace, but it may have something to do with health issues and stuff like that. Let's ask the cards that. <clears throat> oh, tower card. Yeah, some surprise, some type of surprise happening. I'll just stop it right there. So um, there's going to be something that's going to surprise people, and it could have to do with um, the body and the spending and how the spendings are going. Hmm. We're going to have to see next three months. Okay, but people will be stressed out, but, uh, you know, divided and stressed out, but things will finally 
get to a peace or at least the card is saying try to be at peace with yourself at least at the very least and i'm gonna pull an angel for you guys what is the angel message on for us in the next three months here spiritual understanding mm -hmm. try to uh, see the symbols of what's going on there's a lot of messages that spirit is trying to communicate with people and try to understand that the bigger picture of what's spiritually going on and how it's related to the physical world okay so the spirit world is it affects what goes on physically with the world so Kind of look at your own spiritual life, look at other people's spiritual life and say, huh, hey, what's going on? There's going to be some big surprises, and I'm thinking it's going to be May, around May time. So mark my words on that one. Let's see what happens, okay? All right, guys, that's the reading. Joe Biden's presidency for the next three months, April, May, June. Make your reality happen and try to find your peace because if you don't do it, then who will?